<laughs> so normally when we think about oatmeal, we think about maybe some milk, brown sugar, some mm -hmm. raisins, or if you're really fancy, you know those little packs that you tear open and just add some water? That's yeah. what I do. But <laughs> that's too lame. So things are changing. It's not your mama's oatmeal anymore. <laughs> Chef Patrick Fury, one of our favorite people from a great restaurant, Nectar in Berwyn is here. Chef, good to see you again. Yeah, you too. Thanks, good, morning. You. good morning. Nice to meet oh, yeah. you. Curry. Yeah. These are amazing. It's like yeah. these are like meals. Yeah. Yeah. So tell us, how can we make it different? How can we spruce Curry? up our oatmeal? <laughs> What's in there? Well, this is um, actually a steel cut um, oatmeal, which is uh, kind of, they just chop it up, the oats themselves. Um, what's in there is curry, little fish sauce. Uh, we have chilies. We have, um, and actually the base of it, I use coconut milk. Are you, coconut. you must be mad. You put yeah. curry mm -hmm. and, and what? Uh, coconut milk. Coconut milk. What coconut milk. Coconut milk. Uh, fish sauce. Okay. Chilies. Chilies. Yep. Garnish it off with some peanuts, some okay. cilantro, some mint. Oh, cilantro. Little... I love cilantro. And oatmeal. Mm. That's pretty good. I like it. Yeah. I like it. It's different. Thanks. It almost makes it feel like a pasta. <laughs> it almost is it's like risotto. Mm -hmm. Exactly. Yeah. Exactly. That's a good good analogy. All right, what about this one? This is this, blue cheese in it, right? Yeah, this one actually has blue cheese. Um, and then it's finished off. It's actually with uh, some natural milk um, and also chanterelles, parsley. There it is. Oh, blue cheese. Look at that. Now, Here we go. Again, are you mad? <laughs> you have mushrooms in oatmeal. Right. What kind of oatmeal cheese. do you use? This one's actually um, a stone, gra a stone uh, cut. cut. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so it's actually pressed. So it's a different type than the first one. I gotta get a. I love what the blue cheese does. Mm -hmm. Now I like blue cheese on anything. But... Right. This is from one of our, our favorite farmers out in uh, Bertrand. I like that better than the uh, curry. Okay. Yeah. I would yeah. agree. Yeah. yeah. More savory. Are you mad? You would make okay. oatmeal with vodka? No, gin. <laughs> oh, he's mad. Gin. He just gin. knows what he's doing. <laughs> gin. So what we have here again, we have the steel cut. Okay. Um, this is actually made with a uh, buttermilk, mm -hmm. and then we actually finish it off with some goat cheese, some aged goat cheese that's grated. What? Yep. I never thought to put cheese in oatmeal, but I'm yeah. loving it. Yeah. Yeah. And of course, so we have fruit here. Right. So I'm going to do this. And then we're gonna finish it off with some berries. This looks like, you know. Now well, is the gin already in This looks normal there? so far. Not yet. Okay, that's gonna be the finish. This looks normal. So wait a second. And then, uh-oh. Hold on. Here we go. Honey gin from Vermont. Chef, are you mad? What is a honey gin? It's actually made with juniper like? berry. You can try it. Oh, he's just gonna from, drink out of the bottle. Hill, yep, that's what Vermont. I thought. <laughs> this was part of the inspiration. You taste the honey. This is part of the inspiration. A friend of mine actually distills this, and we were up in Vermont, and my kids, and he started showing me about all these different uh, granola people and these these you know oat things, and uh, you know he's like, well, you know, we're going to eat healthy all day, and then we love by it. The, by the third day, we're going to like, all right, we're going to get nuts. Okay, well, this is great. Thank you so <laughs> much. You. you really made this great. A lot of things to think about. I'm not oatmeal is not the same for me. Let's go. We appreciate it. Thank, Thank you, you very much. We'll see you over at your great restaurant Thank called you. Nectar.